So this morning, right, I'm on my way back from the gym and uh, I'm going to pick up my daughter. And, um, you know, I'm just kind of on autopilot, right? As we do sometimes in life. And I go down these certain streets and I go down this one street that ends on this major, on this major street, right? And I'm at this stop sign, right? Or I'm at this stop light rather. And this light is taking forever, right? <laughs> Have you been there where that light seems like it's taking years off your life, right? Okay, so you get the picture. This light is taking forever. So it finally turns green and I'm running late to get my daughter, right? So I finally get to the house, I get her, I get her up to work and you know, we make it there on time, you know, thank God. Now, where she works is very close to the gym. So I find myself taking the exact same route from dropping her off, going back home, right? I took the exact same route, right? Because it's so close to where the gym is. Again, autopilot, just my default, right? My default navigation. I end up taking the exact same route. Why do I share this? Because halfway down the same street that I just took that led to that same cross street with that same doggone light that took forever, right? Halfway down that street, it dawns on me. Oh my God, I'm on the same street again. Oh my God, I can't get off this street. I'm about to end right back up in the same situation, the same scenario that I just suffered about 10, 15 minutes ago when I was first going to get my daughter. I'm back at the same light, the same light that took forever last time. And yup, it took forever again. So in that moment, like I'm inspired to create this video to say, huh, how many times in life are we trying to get somewhere? And we keep finding ourselves back in the same place. Well, we find ourselves back in the same place because we continue to take the same routes. I took the exact same route, right? But it was a default route, right? It was a route where it's just so etched in my brain that I'm on autopilot. I'm not even thinking, right? Whether I'm listening to the radio or I'm listening to a podcast or something, my mind is not on the navigation, right? I know where I'm trying to go home, my destination, but how I get there is very repetitious, very robotic, very default, right? It's the same path every single day. And I ended up suffering the same light, the same weight as I, as I did 10, 15 minutes ago. Now, here's the thing. It was not a enjoyable experience. I didn't like being at that light forever, right? The light, lightweight irritated me. You know what I'm saying? It like, it kind of like, oh my God, really this light is taking forever. And so I really started to think, man, many times in life we are at the same point, keep going to the same place and getting frustrated all over again. And we don't know why. Well, here's the why. And here's something that you can do about it. Okay. The why is because we have these repetitious, robotic, robotic, uh, default navigational uh, instructions etched in our brains when it comes to life, right? I'm talking about on the road, right? Driving, but you can apply this to your life because you keep ending up in the same situation, the same results, the same outcomes, right? Messing with the same people in the same places, right? Having the same feelings and getting in the same moods and it's not pleasurable. It's not really what you really want to experience. Just like I really didn't want to experience the weight at that light again. Well, it's because we're on autopilot. We keep doing the same things, saying the same things, thinking the same things, going the same route day in and day out. And so we keep getting to this familiar place, even though we don't want to be there, even though we don't like it, it's familiar. And so we just keep doing it and there's no break in the algorithm of our lives. There's no break in our GPS of life, right? So here's what you can do about it. You can set an alarm, whatever that alarm is, right? Because what happens is, look at where I ended up. I ended up at the stoplight, 
right at the stop you know at the at the at the red light what i can do is i can back step my tracks i can i can i can start from there and then walk it back how did I get here? Well, I took Second Street. Well, how did I get there? I took this street. How did I get there? I took that street. So you can work backwards from the place where you don't really want to be. Work backwards. How did I get here? Once you get back to your starting point, right, wherever that is for you in life, right? For me, it was, you know, at this, at this particular street, right? Once you get to that starting point, you set up some sort of reminder, an alarm, right? something very practical on your phone. Like for me, um, I know when I go to the gym, I'm gonna leave at about, you know, seven o'clock. Okay, so when I leave the gym, I'm gonna set an alarm, take new route. So at seven o'clock, my alarm is gonna go off and it's gonna tell me, take a different route. Instead of turning left, today you're gonna turn right. By turning right, you're gonna have to take a new street. By taking an, a, a new street, you're gonna have a new experience. By having that new experience, maybe you can avoid the frustrations that you experienced yesterday. Same applies in our lives. Set an alarm, set a reminder. Where's your starting point? Is it when you first wake up? Maybe you need to set the alarm to say, uh, when I first wake up, right? Instead of grabbing my cup of coffee first, I'm gonna read a, a verse in the Bible. Before uh, you know, getting up and just heading to the bathroom, I'm gonna get up and uh, read five reasons why I'm grateful you know, for my life today. I don't know what it is for you, right? But you need to interrupt the pattern, right? You need to interrupt the pattern with some sort of preset alarm because by default, you're gonna do what you've always done. By setting the alarm, it's gonna trigger, right? A memory of that unpleasant experience and then you're gonna have something in place of what you would normally do. You're gonna now do something different and it's gonna bring about a new pattern and hopefully you're gonna avoid the things that frustrate you and get you all, you know, wound up in life. And you're gonna experience something new. You're gonna take a new path. You're gonna, you know, go about your day differently and you're gonna have new uh, exciting experiences and it's gonna open you up to new possibilities. So I hope that makes sense. I hope you guys can apply that to your lives, see some good results. And uh, yeah, man, I'm cheering for you because I know the frustration. <laughs> I feel you, right? So. Use that, put that to work in your life. Try it out, see if it works. Uh, leave me some comments below, drop me a comment. Did it make sense to you? Will you try it? If you tried it and you come back and you got some results, I would love to hear about it as well. So chop it up with me, leave a comment, uh, something, right? Say something to me about it. Did it make sense? Did it hit the mark? Did you need it, right? Was it right on time? Whatever it is, let me know. And uh, yeah, man, I'm praying for you. I'm believing in you. And uh, yeah, I'm cheering you on, man. So. You know, head out and do something new today. You guys be encouraged. Peace.